This is a story about the animal kingdom's kings that draws a parallel to leadership in the real world. To know more about the story, watch till the end. There are only two animals on the planet that the creator has identified himself with. The first one is the eagle and the second animal is the lion. And when I identified those two animals as his favorite to identify himself with, I realized I better study these two animals because if he is the leader of the universe and I intend to be the leader on planet Earth, I better find out the nature of these two animals and also the attitude of these animals. And I discovered that both of them are the kings of their domain. The eagle is the king of the bird kingdom and the lion is the king of the jungle. Let's talk a little bit about the lion. The lion has what I call the spirit of the leadership. And this word spirit here is referring to attitude, everybody's attitude a leader has. An attitude that makes him or her different from followers. Now, the lion is the king of the jungle. But the lion, to me, is a great source of encouragement to all of us. I want you to write down and remember this as long as you live. The lion is not the tallest animal in the jungle. The lion is not the largest animal in the jungle. It is not the heaviest animal in the jungle. Neither the lion is the smartest animal or the most intelligent animal in the jungle. Yet, when he shows up, they all run away. Here's one of my favorite quotes and I truly believe in this. An army of sheep led by a lion will always defeat an army of lions led by a sheep. And the answer is this, leadership can transform cowards into violent warriors. The right kind of leadership can transform timid people into bold people who are fearless. Leadership is that powerful. Leaders can walk into a camp of depressed people and in 20 minutes they can turn into unbelievable powerful arms because leadership determines everything. The lion is the king of the jungle because of one word, attitude. Write it down dear friends, attitude. The lion has a different attitude that makes every animal afraid of him. Now, we don't want to be led by fear but it does take respect for you to become a leader. When I use the word fear, in the jungle, we are talking about respect. The elephant respects the lion, the hyena respect the lion, and the giraffe, they respect the lion. What makes these massive animals respect such a small cat? The attitude is the difference. For example, a lion will see an elephant and the thing that comes to his mind is one word, lunch. I could eat this thing. And he acts the way he thinks. Now here's another amazing mystery. The elephant is larger, bigger, stronger and more powerful, heavier and more intelligent and yet when the elephant sees the lion, one word comes to mind, eater. Attitude is a product of belief and you cannot have an attitude beyond your belief. So your attitude comes from your belief system. The lion is the king because of what he believes about himself. Friends, believe in yourself. Let me know in the comments below if you want to be the leader of the army of sheep or the leader of the lion's army. And I will tell you how you are as a person. Share quickly in the comments. Thank you for watching. This is Life Stories.